guys, Angie here with Angie Makes, and I'm at Canva.com. Now, Canva.com is an amazing resource. It's a free online editor. You can use it to create just about any sort of design that you need. So I'm going to come over here and click Create Design. You can cho choose Custom Dimensions, and I'm going to make a print size document. So I actually am going to make it 12 by 12 inches. That's a high quality print um, size. Now over here on the left you can see we've got some really cool options. So it's going to have these layouts. You can easily create stunning images with these easy layouts. I'm going to undo that real quick because what I'm interested in is this uploads area on the left. So I've already uploaded some clip art. This is available on Angie Makes. It's my Light Garden clip art set. And these are some free swashes that I have on the blog as well. And so I'm going to go ahead and click the swash. It added it to my canvas. I'm going to click off of that. And then I'm going to add this flower. Um, bouquet element and I can resize by just dragging. It's very intuitive to use. So I'm going to actually place that one at the top and you can resize. Again, I'm just clicking and dragging. Very intuitive. Click off and that will allow you to add another image. And I'm going to add this one this time. I'm going to rotate by grabbing this round, these round arrows. And I'm going to resize, rotate a little bit more. And okay, I'm happy with the way that that looks. Um, I'm going to add just some more text. So let's come over here to the text area. Now this is really cool. They have these text layouts that have already paired fonts for you. So I'm going to scroll down until I see this one, which I like. And I'm going to write shine bright. Now I have not clicked around that much in here, but it's very easy. So I'm going to delete this. Delete element very easy to figure out kind of what things do. If you can edit anything in Microsoft Word, then you can use Canva.com. It is pretty simple. Um, right here, I'm going to choose spacing, uh, line height. I'm going to compress that, that down a little bit. I'm going to select this, change the color to maybe a darker gray. And there you have it. Um, I've created a simple printable. You could use this to create a logo design with some pre-made clip art elements that you upload. You could a business card, a flyer, anything, and it's pretty quick. Um, you saw how quickly I was able to create that, so now I'm going to just save it by clicking up here, download. Ping has a transparent background. JPEG, you're going to get a white background and download it, and voila! I hope you guys enjoy using Canva.